to understand differences, respect differences, and be inspired by those differences as a source of strength and not as dividers. For me, the most special thing about Dean Olean is her commitment to women's leadership. This conference comes at a key moment for women. Women are standing up and speaking out courageously. She doesn't regard herself as someone so distant from students. She can sit down and have a conversation with you as if you're her peer. I'm very lucky because as Dean, I get to meet our Anderson alumni family in cities across the country and around the world. You are part of that growing Anderson family. Dean Judy is not only a dear friend, I think she's the best of the 15 deans that I've had in my career. Ladies and gentlemen, a new gift of $100 million. I'm delighted to welcome Steve Ballmer, former CEO of Microsoft, Jack Dorsey, CEO of Twitter, Executive VP and CFO of Gap Inc., Chief Content Officer for Netflix, the CEO of Riot Games, CEO, co-founder of DraftKings, CEO of Sony Entertainment, the Executive Chairman and former CEO of Google, Amy Iovine, Head of Apple Music. Before you sit down, please flash your sneakers. Oh, dear. Look at those Bruins sneakers. Are they not great? My first time I met Judy was over dinner, right? We'd sent in a report. She wanted to go through it. She had marks on every page, really, it was like a 100 page deck, right? She's like, on page 57, what did you mean by this point? Yeah. I know you're passionate about being dean of this great management school. Totally. 24 it, 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 it exceeds from you, and that's why you're so good at it. But after 12 years living her life for Anderson, we are better off for having had Judy Olean as our dean. I am so proud of you. I have loved getting to know you. Anderson will continue to be distinguished, forward-looking, inclusive. This is a great family. This is what we stand for here at Anderson. Accept failure as part of your learning growth cycle and know yourself deeply.